Stories for boys who dare to be different. Alan Turing. During the Second World War, countries would speak to each other using codes to prevent their enemies from understanding their messages. The most important and difficult code was used by the Germans. It was called Enigma. Britain desperately needed to crack it. If they could, they'd know all of their enemies' secrets, including their next moves. But it was almost impossible. There was only one person they could think of who might be able to help, Alan Turing. Alan had loved numbers ever since he was a child. He wasn't encouraged at school, but when he got to university, Alan flourished. He was studying pure mathematics. Then his unusual way of thinking led him to look for practical ways of using maths. He wanted to change the way people lived in a useful manner. He published a paper that turned out to signal the beginning of modern computers. Once they brought him in, Alan helped the government break the Enigma code by building a machine called the bomb. Some people think that, by cracking the code, Alan shortened the war by four years, which would mean he saved millions of lives. In 1952, police heard rumors that he was gay. At the time, being gay was still a crime, and he was arrested. Alan was found guilty. Even after what he had done for the country, he was given the choice of jail or taking drugs that would supposedly change him. He chose the drugs, and they made him sick. It hurt so much that he poisoned himself and died. But he was never forgotten. 61 years later, in 2013, Alan was granted a posthumous royal pardon, and four years after that, in 2017, Turing's law was passed, pardoning all men who had ever been convicted of anything related to being gay. His great-niece, Rachel Burns, thinks it's tremendous, but wants people to remember that Alan was a lot more than just his sexuality. He was an incredibly intelligent, devoted and forward-thinking person who have saved the lives of countless others.